Hello, I'm Nishant. I'm just going to show you how to configure Tomcat Apache on your system right now. Before doing anything, you have to download two files. In your email, you can see two links. The one is Tomcat and the another one is KDK. If you just click the Tomcat link, you will end up here. You can see the code below that there is a thing zip. You just click it and download the file. And if you go for the JDK, because you need to run Tomcat, you need a Java environment to set up that, you need JDK. You just go to here, and before that, you just make sure which version of Windows you are using. Maybe some people use 32 and some people use 64 bit. So if you just go to the start, computer, properties, and you can see your which version. Right now, I'm using 32 bit. So I'm just going to download the 32 bit version. Okay, after downloading the two files, just create a folder like I was created in the desktop. If you see, uh, if you open the folder, you can see two files. One is JDK and another one is Tomcat. Just extract the Tomcat raw file and you can see a folder like this. Just install the JDK. I already installed in my system. It's just a simple installation. You just need to click next, next, and it will be installed. After installing the JDK, just go to the start, computer, C, program files. But uh, most of if some people using 64 bit, make sure you enter program files because in your system you will see two files program files and program files x86. People get confused because x86 is a 32 bit version. For example, if you're going to install a 30 bit version software it will be automatically installed in the 32 bit that program files x86 so make sure you entered in the correct program files and you can just search for a java folder name yeah here and you can see probably see you can see two folders one is jre and jdk if you see this you have successfully installed it after that you have to configure the environment you have to set up the environment right now just go to the start computer properties you can see advanced system settings and environment variable and system variable just make a new just create, click a new and then maybe java and the home and the variable value is just go to the jdk folder bin and just top of the just right click and copy the address and go to your and paste it here okay then you want to create another one it's jre underscore home same procedure just go to the jre folder then copy the address and paste it there okay do we have to check it whether it, i configured it correctly or not just go to the uh, start open the command and just type java and then if you see some options that options include this kind of stuff then it's successfully installed the next final step is we need to install the tomcat it's just simple just go to the folder you created in the desktop and try open bin copy the address and just open go to the command panel login and type cd paste and paste the address that your tomcat address and just enter and it will ask the setup file you have to start up start just s type st and press tab just enter it okay there is one problem actually the JR environment is set up wrong it says let me check with your computer properties advanced system settings and uh, environment variables just find it just delete it or edit it and just remove the bin okay do the same thing just exit the command open the command again cd, CD paste Yes, enter and yes, P, press tab, enter. 
yeah it's installing okay just click allow uh, I'm really sorry for the alarm it happens sometimes when you record something <laughs> I'm sorry for that okay after that just go to your web browser new tab just type local or semicolon 8080 enter and you probably see this and that's it that's all it was successfully installed your phone can that's it if there is any doubt any it was stuck up in any way you just call me anyway thanks for watching this thank you